Paul and Silas traveled to Philippi. When Paul suggested to Barnabas they go and visit the places they had been to on their first trip, Barnabas agreed but wanted to take John Mark with them. Paul did not want John Mark to go as he had deserted them on their first trip. The disagreement between them was sharp and they separated. So Barnabas and John Mark set off together. They sailed for Cyprus to visit the Christians there and encourage them. Paul teamed up with Silas and the church in Antioch entrusted them to God's care as they set off. They headed to Syria and into the region of Cilicia. Silas was able to share the letter the leaders in Jerusalem had written to help and encourage the Gentile Christians. Both men taught God's word to help the churches grow stronger in faith. They then moved on to Derby and the other nearby places Paul had visited on his first trip. At Lystra, they met a young Christian called Timothy. His mother was a Jewish believer, but his father was a Greek. The local Christians thought very highly of him and Paul invited Timothy to join them on their journey. Paul, Silas and Timothy went from town to town, instructing the believers to follow the decisions made by the apostles and elders in Jerusalem. The churches were strengthened in their faith and grew larger every day. Next Paul and Silas traveled through the area of Phrygia and Galatia. They considered going south into Asia but the Holy Spirit redirected them. So they headed north for the province of Bithynia, but again the Spirit of Jesus did not allow them to go there. So instead, they went on through Mysia to the seaport of Troas. That night Paul had a vision. A man from Macedonia in northern Greece was standing there, pleading with him, come over to Macedonia and help us. When Paul shared this with Silas and Timothy they concluded that God was calling them to Macedonia in Greece to preach the good news there. So, they packed up at once and headed out. They boarded a boat at Troas and sailed straight across to the island of Samothrace, and the next day landed at Neapolis. From there they reached Philippi, a major city of the district of Macedonia and a Roman colony. On the Sabbath they went outside the city to a riverbank, where people were meeting for prayer. One of them was Lydia from Thyatira, a merchant of expensive purple cloth, who worshipped God. As she listened to Paul share the good news about Jesus, the Lord opened her heart, and she became a Christian. She was baptized along with other members of her household. She invited Paul, Silas and Timothy to stay as guests at her home while they were in Philippi. If you like this video give it a thumbs up. Share and leave a comment. Subscribe.